Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Happy Sunday, I'm back from, uh, from the national and a little mini vacay. Here I am with 2022 Panini Legacy Football, four box, pick your team, number three. Now if you bought at least two teams, you've seen us do this a lot. If you bought it, buy at least two teams, that's one entry for this promo. Four, four teams gets you two entries, so on and so forth. We'll randomize those entries. Top two will get $125 of break credit each. So the only thing that ships here is inserts, rookie cards, number cards, and hits. Big thanks to this group here for getting into the action on a Sunday, Sunday the 7th. Pick your team three, Legacy Football. Uh, David, I almost said Danny Duffy, that's, that's, a, that's a baseball player on the Dodgers, I want to say. David Duffy with Last Spot Mojo, Falcons, and here's everybody else. Danny Duffy's trying to make his way back from the IL, I want to say. All right, so I think Jason opened up uh, the big 24 box case and did the first eight boxes. Uh, breaks one and two, four boxes each. Uh, here's another four box that I randomly grabbed. Good luck. Got 13 laps left in the, uh, in the NASCAR race on in the background. They're in Michigan. Kevin Harvick leading by like four seconds right now with 12 laps to go. Bubba Wallace in, uh, in second place. Uh, yeah, I don't think he's played yet. I think he's still working his way back from whatever injury he had to, that he was dealing with. Maybe he got re-injured? I'm not sure, but. And I think it's been a, for NASCAR fans out there, I'll, I think I want to say it's been a minute or two since Kevin Harvick's won a race, right? Has he, been, has he won this season? I don't know if he has, but I know there's been a bit of a drought. The, uh, some of the next-gen cars that some drivers have been getting used to. Oh no, he went at Bristol, looks like. Or maybe that was his last win? I'm not sure. All right, box number one. So I think, yeah, Legacy, you're going you're gonna to see the rookies still in their college gear, but we start, we get, we get pro logos now next to them, which I'm sure, the, uh, I'm sure the shipping team really appreciates. makes it a lot easier to, to sort and ship out the football. So all those rookie cards will ship. All those numbered cards will ship. Is uh, is Kenny Pickett going to be QB1? He is, right? I don't know if there's anyone really in his way. Obviously, these little guys will ship too. Raiders did all right. I mean, it's sort of hard to really judge. But, yeah, the Raiders did all right in the, in the Hall of Fame game. There's Jermaine Johnson at the second. Rookie autograph for Patrick and the Jets. I mean, it's really hard to, to see, you know, in an exhibition game like that. But they won the game. That's good. I, like to, I always like to see a W. Um, Josh Jacobs actually played the first quarter, which I think surprised which I think surprised a lot of people. But I think he's really trying to show that, hey, I deserve uh, deserve uh, to get some good playing time. Raiders drafted uh, the Georgia running back, Zamir White, who, who looked really good. I think one of the big issues, of course, is the offensive line. I think, uh, you know, I think they're really going to have to figure out 
you know, maybe try to shore up the tackle position on both sides, right? And left and right side, I feel like. So hopefully the, they can shore that up or at least improve from preseason game to preseason game. And then that'll put the Raiders in a pretty good position. There's DeAndre Hopkins to the Cardinals to 199. Pretty good position to, I don't know what. That's to 50, that's under the lights insert. Well, I guess the, I guess these little little minis don't have the team name attached to it, but that is that is uh, Jahan Dotson. So we'll make sure our shipping team will make sure it goes to the right team. We'll go by the checklist, of course. There is Jalen Tolbert to 149 for Dallas. That's going to be for Cody. It's a 2.99 Debo Samuel. I want to say Debo got paid, right? He got some sort of little extension. And we got Romeo Dobbs, 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 for Green Bay. That'll be for Aaron Miller and the Packers. That's right, Jack. Raiders are due for a little, some good mojo. You know, last season was a little, uh, you know, even though they made it to the playoffs, it was a little hectic. All right, there's box number one. It was a little hectic. But hopefully with... Fresh coaching, new coaching staff, sort of a fresh start for everybody. All the additions they made. So hopefully they'll, uh, you know, hopefully. It's going to be a tough, it's a tough division. But each week should be a battle. It should, each week should be, at least, at the very least, entertaining. AFC West going to be high score. Is it, though? Look at the defenses, too. There are a lot of improvements on the defenses in the AFC West as well. You know, I think the Chargers improved their defense. The Raiders certainly improved their defense. And, uh, Chandler Jones. Remember, Khalil Mack is in, 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 uh, on the Chargers now. So, I don't know. Is, is under the play? Maybe, maybe sneaky unders? If you're if you're into that sort of thing, final lap. Kevin Harvick still at four seconds ahead of Bubba Wallace. Yeah, Gilo saying Broncos had a decent offense, just no one to run it. In his opinion, well, they they lost a player, right? Did they lose a receiver that was supposed to be a good part of their offense? Tim Patrick, maybe. Kevin Harvick, checker flag. All right, box two of four. We got CD Lamb to two ninety nine for the Cowboys. And we've got, for the Ravens, rookie auto David Ojabo for uh, Michael Gallucci and the Ravens. We saw Michael at the Nationals. Good to see you. There you go, Mike. We were, wish we had some more time to hang out, but I appreciate seeing your face. Go 
Kyler Murray to 150. I think he ended up getting paid while while I was away, right? They they figured that contract stuff out with him. Here's another mini for the Chargers. That's to 75. That is Isaiah Spiller, rookie mini. We got a orange, 105 out of 199. Alec Pierce for the Colts. That Colt is going to go to Jeremy. Who no longer has to watch? Oh, um, Kyler Murray? Yeah, there was that weird contract clause, right? Is that is that out now? Did they take that out? It's Kenny Pickett. I feel like we have not seen any of the other quarterbacks here, but there's Kenny Pickett for Michael and the Steelers. Oh, they took the claws out. There's Davis Mills to 50. Yeah, I don't know what that was about. But... Trayvon Walker mini. A very weird thing to put in a yeah, I know there's a lot of speculation out there about why we're not going to get into that but yeah you know clearly there was a reason why they kind of slipped that in there but there's Damian Pierce rookie auto for the Texans Eric Leal ad saying it was really about him playing Call of Duty no one else in the NFL plays Call of Duty it's just him huh And there's Joe Burrow right there. Every fall he plays worse after the game comes out. Well, maybe that is an issue. Maybe they had to put that in the in the contract. Next one. There's Kevin Harvick with the W in Michigan. Congrats to him. Box three of four for us. Yeah, when does Call of Duty usually come out? Is it what week in the season? Week eight after his body's been punished? That's what that's what Will's saying. Yeah, he's got. A, I don't think he really takes the bad hit though, does he? I feel like he's a little more Russell Wilsony in that sense, where he's able to avoid the uh, to avoid the big hit. Right, third box, good luck. We'll give away a little money too. Yeah, the legacy of football, I think these should be called classics, right? That's to 199, that's uh, Trey McBride, speaking of the Cardinals. Legacy always kind of marks the, uh, the sort of, hey, football season is around the corner, at least for me, hobby-wise. You know, you start to think, oh, yeah, I got to start learning all these players. What, 
you know, what teams they go on. We finally get pro logos on here. This, this really starts to get me warmed up for the, uh, for the football season. Now, G-Lo liked classics better. I like legacy better. Was, I feel like there was way too many cards in uh, classics. There's Darnell Mooney at 299. Some people talking about, I mean, I feel like Darnell Mooney's been talked about as a fantasy sleeper for years now, but Darnell, there's Darnell Mooney. And there's another David Ojabo rookie autograph for the Ravens. That'll be for Michael. No, Will, you went on a long rant about Legacy last year? Well, look to our videos last year for, uh, for Will's thoughts on Legacy. I don't mind it. I mean, there's so many football sets, right? There's bound to be many sets that you're going to like and not like. There's Legend, Steve Atwater to 150 for Denver. There's Desmond Ritter for the Falcons. That's going to go to David Duffy. There's second year T Law. Trey McBride, autograph, rookie auto for. The Cardinals, Michael with the Cardinals, Michael G. Panini needs vintage sets, Gilo is saying. What, how, how do you mean? And there's Randall Cunningham to 100 for the ages insert. Oh, you like the vintage looking sets like classics. I got it, I got it, I got it. Well, you know, Fanatics does have the football license, so maybe maybe they'll they'll be a, you know, with the might be more introduction of uh, of older sets being reintroduced as a new set perhaps. Could be a thing. All right, fourth and final box, and we'll give away some money. Next four-box break in the store. I think we are in single digits on break number four. You can check jazbeescasebreaks.com. Fourth and final box. Good luck, everybody. There's Malik Willis to 100 for the Titans. That'll be for EA. There's Tyler Batty, Beatty, for the Ravens. Rookie auto, another Raven rookie auto for Michael. Mm -hmm. 
the numbers didn't really print right there. I see two ninety nine. Another Kenny Pickett for the Steelers. That'll be for Michael Gallucci and his Steelers. And the final half. We're going to have to TBD on which one of those receivers are really going to emerge as the one to chase in the hobby. Here's Legends to 199, Deuce McAllister. There is a mini Justin Fields to 125 for the Bears. Jamar Chase, Chad Johnson to 125, Generations. Insert for the Bengals. And we've got a 24 out of 35 for the Chiefs. That's Trent McDuffie. Gilo, tell me, tell us about, he's a Chiefs guy. Tell us about Trent McDuffie. That is for uh, Aaron W. and the Chiefs. 24 out of 35. And the last bits right here. There you go. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. A legacy four box break in the books. So let's flip back over here. And let's see who's going to win that money. Chad Da thinks that uh, Trent McDuffie's overrated in his humble husky opinion. Gilo saying, hey, first round pick. I did watch the Hall of Fame game on replay. All right. Um, so by an even number of teams, half of those become entries for break credit. So let's sort your names by uh, first name. Aaron W. got a team, two teams, that's one entry. Adam got two teams, that's an entry. Brian V., two teams, one entry. EA, two teams, one entry. EL, two teams, one entry. And Michael with Michael Gallucci with six teams, that's three entries. Nestor, two teams, one entry. Patrick Davis, two teams, one entry. And then just one team each there. So let me just kind of spot check this again to make sure I got it. So that's pretty good odds to get some break credit. I got Aaron, I got Adam, not Austin, not Bill. Brian V, not Brian W, not Cody, not EA, yes, EL, yes. Got one teams each right there, Michael. Teams right there, there's Nestor. Nick only got one teams, Patrick and Peter. Victor. All right, great. Let's get some uh, new dice, some new list. Let's gather everybody's name. So two of the 10 spots are going to get $125 of break credit each. Not too shabby. Let's roll it, randomize it. Uh, one and a six. Top two after seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. And good luck. Seventh and final time, right? One more. Yes, one more. Seventh and final time. It's going to be Michael. You get both, I'm gonna send both of those break credits in one, so check that out, congrats to you. Hey, thanks everyone for watching Breaking With Us. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'm back. We'll see you next time for the next break, bye-bye.